So I just woke up. Um, well, I didn't just wake up. I've been in bed for... Oh, I don't even know what the time is. It's probably like 11 o'clock. It's ridiculous. I'm having one of those gloomy days today. Um, I'm in between jobs. So I've had the last three weeks off work. Um, I've been wanting to post more on this channel, but I've just been feeling a bit like... Blah. <laughs> I don't know. And I was laying in bed and I was thinking, you know what? I just want to get out of the house. And one thing I've been wanting to do for a really long time is um, create a desk in that corner of the room. So I really want to put up shelves. Um, I've got these beautiful planters coming soon. They've got little faces on them. Um, and I really just want to like get on top of all the housework. I need to do a lot of washing. Um, I need to do a bit of cleaning around the house, some vacuuming. I haven't done the vacuuming in a while. Um, I've got a Mickey Mouse shirt on if you want to know. Um, and yeah, I, I want to go to the op shops um, or thrift stores if you're um, American. But I really want to go to the op shops and I want to see if I can find a really nice desk. I'm looking for a white desk. I'm also looking for shelves and if I can find little bits of stationery, vintage like um, bits and pieces like um, stamps or anything, I want to do that. So I think I'm going to get up, get dressed and I think I might take you around the day today and just do a little bit of vlogging and cleaning and maybe this afternoon I'll put together a stationary office desk. If not, I might continue this vlog for a next day or for another day until I find a desk and I can put that together. Kitchen before and after. Before, after. So my last before and after is me. Before, after. <laughs> All right, so I'm ready to go. Um, I just remembered that I need to put the washing out. <laughs> so I'm going to go do that first. But I just wanted to show you my plant before I leave. It's dying. I had to move it to the sun. So I stripped the um, under the plant all the leaves. And it just doesn't look very good. I don't know what to do with it. So hopefully the sun will come down and shine it and bring it back to life. Um, so today, um, I really want to look for a stationary desk, some storage, and maybe find a few more vintage stamps. I really like the stamps they have at Op Shop. So yeah, let's go Op Shopping! So we're going to Goodwill Op Shop today. I'm so sad that this one's sold. This would have been perfect. Look how cute these drawers are. <laughs> I would have loved that. I know I love watercolor, but do you reckon I'll ever use this? I've got paints at home that I never use. I don't need it. Oh, get out there. Yeah, I don't think I'll ever use oil color either. Jackpot. Yes. Yes. What I like about you. I love these. I hope they're still 20 cents. <laughs> This is how you eat sushi when you're in the car <laughs> on the lab yummy i'm so excited for sushi so um so we are just in the car and i'm eating some sushi because i'm so hungry it is 1 45 um and i'm going to go to um i'm at office work sorry i couldn't even say it then um i'm at office work so i'm just gonna have a quick bite and then i'm gonna see if we've got any nice white desks um and then we're gonna go home and we're gonna um i'll show you all my goodies that i bought i got so many good little vintage um, things that I can create pen pal letters with. So I'm going to eat my sushi, go into office work, see if I can find a flat pack um, desk, and then I can start creating my craft desk. 
So I'm just in that corner over there. In the white car back there? Um, the one next to the truck on that side. Yeah, yeah, no, the white one. Look at my new desk. Well, the flat pack of my new desk. <laughs> It took me a lot of effort to get this box inside. I had to just like kind of um, push it the whole way from my car to here. So this box is so heavy. I think it said it was like 40 kilos. Oh no, 16 to 30 kilos. So it can be up to 30 kilos. So yeah, it's very heavy. Um, so let's put the flat pack together. Great yellow sun is reflecting in your deep blue eyes. The day has begun. You spin around, you spin around, you laugh to yourself. And I see you shine in every color, resting your head in my arms. You sing. We've just got to put it in the room so we've got to rearrange my bedroom which my partner didn't really want but I'm thinking now that my table might look nice in front of the window but at the same time I don't think my bed's gonna fit so I think the only space is this one so we're gonna have to make move this bed that way all right let's start rearranging this room I'm so excited! <laughs> I got this piece from the art shop um, on the bottom it says wild strawberry <laughs> do you know the song wild strawberries I think by Penal so I want to put um, pens in that one so I think I'm gonna put this one over this side um, and I'm just trying to figure out how to design this little table so obviously my laptop will probably go there and then I need to figure out what's gonna go um, also, I could find some few things to go in this drawer as well. So, I'm just trying to figure out what to put. So, so far, I've got these two. So, I've got my dried flowers and my washi tape. And then on the other side, I'm going to put some pens. So, I'm still just trying to design. So, that's why I'm doing a little bit of a time lapse with you guys. So, you already know that I got these three Frankies. Um, I thought they were really cute. And they're going to be great to cut pictures out of. 
Um, I'll show you. There was one that I really loved. Oh, yeah, this one. Look how beautiful that is. I really liked that. So that's why I got this book. Um, so I'll pop those aside in a second. And these are the things that I got from the last um, op shop. So this was from Salvo. So look at all these stamps. Oh my goodness. I'm going to have so much fun going through these and decorating envelopes with those. And I got two of them because there were so many of them. There was three packs all together, but um, there were eight bucks each. So I only got two packs. But I thought that was plenty. Like, that's going to last me for years. And I can send heaps to you guys if you want some stamps as well. Um, this is really cool. So, I thought this was awesome. So, this is a really old stamp album. And it's got stamps from all over the world. So, Australia. And the pages are, like, really old and, like, tattered and falling apart. Um, let me show you some. So, this is... China, Chile. So they've collected stamps, whoever had this before me, from all over the world. So Germany, haven't even heard of that one. Greece, Holland. Now I love this. You guys are going to love this a lot. Well, I hope so. So these were $3 each, and I thought they were 20 cents. That's why I got a whole bunch of them. But they're $3. Let me get rid of this newspaper. So, they're really old um, comics. And I just thought they were the cutest. And I loved them. So, Popeye. Um, Donald Duck. And Mickey Mouse. I was actually wanting to like put them on the wall. But I, I thought I might frame them. I really don't want to cut these up because they're so beautiful. And lastly are these parchment rolls. So look at the front of them. They're just so pretty. And I just had to get them because I thought they would be really awesome to craft with. But now I'm not sure if I would even want to wreck them. I think I might want to... How beautiful is that? That's what this is. I could wrap things with this. That's really cool. Oh my goodness. I could just wrap I could wrap letters with this um, paper. They were three dollars each, so I might actually go back and get some more. going for so it's sort of like a vintage um, themed look so the frame used to sit up there so I really need to put something there now because it looks so bare so I couldn't actually find any twine I really wanted that nice twine but all I've got is this or um, or ribbon so I'm gonna have to just put that on there for now until I find something else that's nicer yes this is perfect so I got this pin from um, Japan I paid ten dollars for it because I thought it was vintage. It, this pin is from. Let me tell you. This pin is from 1932. So that is going on the board. That's really cool. How cute is it? So I found it at a little retro store. Oh, I don't even know if I found it. Retro store. There was like this long strip, I think, in Osaka. It was near like a fish market. It was so cool. If you can see at the bottom, it says 19. So I thought this was just a bit of a
that gap there in the center. I don't know, I kind of think it looks nice because there's so much going on in each kind of a cluster that it doesn't really need something in the center, especially if I'm going to be working. I'll probably have all my glues and stuff there. But I think I like it. So I've added a few little things. So I've added this little guy here. I got him from Japan. I also added in my little robot. I thought he was pretty cute. So you can see little bits and pieces. And then over here you can see I added in my ice cream man and my ice cream cone. I thought they were really cute too, so I thought I'd add them in. You can't really see them from a distance, but when you look up close there's lots of detail. And I'll show you this up here. So as you can see I've got envelopes here. I've got this boarding pass from the, um, what's it called, Traveler's Factory. I've got a few more stamps here. If you go down a little I've ripped out um, this from the old book that's on the desk. There's a little button here that I got from a really small stationery stop shop in Japan. Um, this underneath was given to me. I thought it looked quite um, Japanese-y as well. I'm not sure if it's from Japan or China, that one, or if it's from an another country, actually. So the badge in the middle is Astro Boy. I got these really big stamps ages ago. And then these are the stamps in my stamp um, bundle I got from the op shop today. This one I added in just because it had an address and I thought it was cool because it's gold and shiny. Um, these are the stamps I also got today. This little guy I got out of a gachapon. I also got the badge from a gachapon. And then these little guys I found from a really small boutique store when I was in Japan. So as I mentioned before, so there it is. I think it's really cute. It's like a collection of all my favourite things.